Hello, Rambler fans. I'm Isabel Roosevelt, and I'm joined by... Kathy Booker. Hi, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm pretty good. So I've got a couple questions for you, just to let the McBain community get to know you. Um, my first being, how long have you been teaching? I've been teaching for a long time. So I moved to Michigan in 1996 after graduating uh, from college with mm -hmm. a teaching degree. So I've been around for a while. <laughs> oh, where have you taught before then? I have taught in Traverse City, I've taught in Cadillac, I've mm -hmm. taught in Grand Rapids, and I've taught in Vestaburg, Michigan. Wow. Um, where did you go to school? I went to school at Indiana State University. So if you've ever heard of Larry Bird, mm -hmm. the basketball player, yeah. that's where I went to school. That's awesome. Um, what's your favorite book? My favorite book is All the Light We Cannot See. Oh, wow. What's that one about? So that is a World War II drama okay. that follows a young French blind girl whose father is a curator at a Paris museum. Hmm. And it's a parallel story with a young German boy that gets sucked up into the Third Reich. And their, their wow. connections meet uh -huh. because he is... Um, unfortunately has to help this general find the item that this girl might have and he realizes how wrong all of this is so oh, it's a wow. really great story that's awesome I'm gonna have to read that one um my next question is are what are some of your favorite hobbies so I love to read, mm -hmm. that's my biggest one. And I love to swim, so I like to be in the water. So mm -hmm. anytime that I can go swimming or be on the boat or do anything near water, that's me. That's and awesome. we live in the woods, so mm -hmm. we like to hike. Yes. On the topic of favorites, what's mm -hmm. your favorite music genre? Oh, my music, it's probably Americana. I like kind of folksy mm -hmm. and um, stuff that can kind of lift the spirit and yet get you motivated. That's awesome. Um, what's a standard you live by? A standard that I live by? Mm -hmm. A standard that I live by is uh, no regrets. Mm -hmm. Because I've lived a long life that has seen things that I, I don't want to have any regrets with the decisions that I make. So that's mm -hmm. my standard that I live by. That's all. That's a really good standard. And then my final question before we get on to some trivia to let you get oh in the vein. Mm -hmm. um, what persuaded you to be a teacher? Well, I wanted to be a teacher from the time that I was a little girl. So mm -hmm. I was, when growing up, when we were going to school, we would have textbooks and mm -hmm. then they would age out and the schools would then sell the textbooks and so they'd put a table out in the hallway. Mm -hmm. So even in elementary school, I would come home and ask my mom for quarters. Can I have a quarter? And then I would come home with like expired teacher's mm -hmm. editions. And then I would want to play school at, ha at home. Mm -hmm. yes. I was not very popular with play groups. So, you know, mm -hmm. kids didn't want to leave school and then come home and play school. So that mm -hmm. was me. But I knew that it was something that I just loved doing. Mm -hmm. And the more that I got into it, the more I enjoyed the atmosphere and the work, the help, the interaction mm -hmm. of learning. Yeah. That's amazing. Um, so now for the McBain trivia, okay. I've asked these to some of the other teachers I've interviewed. The first question is, when did the school burn down? Oh my gosh. I don't know. 1928. 1928? Yes. Okay, if you look around the school, they have all those composites. <laughs> the earliest one is 1929. There we go. Yes. Okay, I didn't know that. Oh, uh, what is the name of the food truck that frequents the Keystone? I don't even know what the Keystone is. It's like one of the gas stations down there. The food truck. Nope, I don't know that one either. It's called Betsy's Brats. Yeah. Uh, when is homecoming and why? Oh, I do know this one. Okay. I just learned this okay. one. It's basketball. Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. And I don't know the full reason whether or not it's because of uh, weather or whether it's because of sports participation. But I do know it's basketball. I yes, know that it is during basketball season, and you were kind of right with the uh, sports participation. We didn't have a football team from 1937 to 1971. There we go. See, yes. I didn't know that part. That's good to know. Oh, and then my last one. Why are we called the Ramblers? I don't know. <laughs> So we used to only have that like half a basketball court. Yes. So all of our games had to be away. So we would ramble along the countryside. Oh my so gosh. We're the ramblers. That's great to yes. know. <laughs> we need like a little pamphlet that we hand out. The kids. Yeah. Because I'm not from McBain. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I live in between here and Lake City. So, 
you know, Big Bane has always been go to the feed store or, mm-hmm. you know, <laughs> small little visits. Absolutely. Get pizza at Kelly's, you know. <laughs> well, that is all of my questions for you. So thank you for your time and thank you for all your answers. Thank you so much. This was fun. <laughs>